Hello everyone, this is Tasneem Abouid and today I'm gonna recite a monologue by Romeo and Juliet from the well-known play Romeo and Juliet by William Shakespeare. I hope you'll enjoy it. This is torture and not mercy. Heaven is here where Juliet lives and every cat and dog and little mouse. Every unworthy thing live here in heaven and may look on her. But Romeo may not. More validity, more honorable state, more courtship lives in carrying of flight than Romeo. They might seize on the white wonder of dear Juliet's hand. The steel of Martin pressing from her lips, who even in a pure and vestal modesty still blush, as thinking their own kisses soon. But Romeo may not, he is banished. Flies may do this, but I am from this must fly. They are free men, but I am punished, and sayest thou yet that exiles is not dead? Hadst thou no poison mixed? No sharp ground knife, no sudden mean of death, though never been so mean. But banished to kill me, banished! O oh, friar, the damned used that word in hell, how long attended, how hast thou the heart? Being a divine, a ghostly confessor, a sin absolver, and my friend professed to mangle me with that word, punished. Shall I speak all of him? That's my husband. Ah, poor my lord, what tongue shall smooth thy name when I, thy three hours wife, have mangled it? But wherefore, villain, didst thou kill my cousin? That villain cousin would have killed my husband. Back, foolish tears, back to your native spring, your tributary drops belong to you. But you mistaken offer up to joy. My husband lives. That tipple would have slain, and tipple's dead that would have slain my husband. Oh, this is comfort. Wherefore we by then? Some word there was worse than Tipple's death that murdered me, I would forget it vain. But oh, it presses to my memory like damned guilty deeds to sinner's mind. Tipple's is dead and Dromio punished. That banished. That one word banished has slain ten thousand tipples. Tipples that was ooh, enough if it had ended there, or if sour who delights in fellowship and needy will be ranked with other griefs. Why followed not when she said tipples that thy father or thy mother? Nay, or both, which modern lamentations might have moved. But with a rare word following Tipple's death, Romeo is banished. To speak that word is father, mother, Tipple's Romeo, Juliet, all slain, all dead. Romeo is banished. There's no end, no limit, measure, bound in that word's death. No words can that woo sound. 